Welcome back to Modern Art Blitz. My name is Matt Gleason. This episode, number 55, in our long history, we've already featured Jill Sykes, we've already featured Sandra Vista, but for part three, we have a painter of, well, we're gonna decide, finally, for the record, exactly what he's a painter of. It's a great debate, actually. People say, what, what does Lauren paint? Who is Lauren? And we're going to find out. Ladies and gentlemen, Lauren Phillip. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Matt. Now, it's not Thank Phillips. No, I was very good. There was no plural That's there. That's right. It's, uh, Do you pat people on the back? Pat, pat one me L, on the back. no S. Pat That's me on the what back. we always have to say. Yeah, okay, okay. One L, no S. That's right. Wow, okay. And you wanted the germs, you got them. Here, turn to the, turn to the people here and show them his... Man, I'm envious of your germs t-shirt. Nice, I wore so, it just for you, Matt. Well, you know, thank you very much. Hey, um, so Lauren, tell me, uh, do you consider yourself an abstract painter? Yes. You are? Absolutely. We're, it's, it's firm now. Yes. People are trying to say there's imagery, there, it's referencing. No, it's pure yes. abstraction. I, I do, yeah. I consider you're, myself a topographical abstractionist. To oh, topographical abstractionist. What is the difference between pure abstraction i.e., let's say, Ad Reinhardt or those guys, you know, Willem de Kooning, and a topographical abstract painter like yourself? Well, I work, the influence is always the environment, and ah. so I'm always constantly uh, working with uh, an abstraction of some, some element of the environment. Uh, most of my work is extremely influenced by, um, by the environment, by being in California. Uh, I was raised here. Uh, I surf and I BMX and even so, so there's an element of, of all of that that kind of... So when we're looking at in. your painting, there, there should be some kind of uh, uh, well, regional topography here, is that... It's not so much regional um, per se, I mean there are This times, could be Tibet? That's right, this could okay. be, this is actually um, kind of a, uh, a catalyst piece that, that I did, this is called um, Cars Hiss By My Window. Oh. Um, and it was the beginning of shifting from um, some work that I that was a little bit uh, I want to say soft in its in its uh, in its contest. There was there was there was more curves. It was a little bit more of a, a sensual quality, I think, to some of the earlier work. This kind of became a, a, a it broke through some barriers, and then as we move forward from here, it kind of all came out of this, and then the previous work. Cool. Um, so, what year is this? This is, uh, this is recent, this is uh, last year. Okay, so you, 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 came through, you had a breakthrough recently. Yeah. And you're just not as lyrical as you used to be. You're, you're <laughs> a little more, you're, you're, you're not afraid to get in there and do, do some battle with it? No, I, I, that's pretty much all I do. I mean, I kick, scream, curse, cry, at pretty much every painting. Yeah. Um, Big fight? Yeah, I'm constantly fighting with myself, absolutely. Um, it's, uh, it's, it's not easy. And, and uh, let me ask, oil paint? Uh, no, this is, Predominantly all acrylic. Sometimes I'll mix with um, enamel. Really? Yeah. Wow. Does, and and does, does enamel really mix with acrylic? Help me out here. Um, yeah. I don't want to find out it's not archival in five years <laughs> if I own one, right? Help me out. I have no idea. No? You're just, you're, you're, so you're, you're... I just do it. Okay, let me, let me ask you, where do you get your acrylic paint? Do you want to plug a certain brand? Uh, no? You, yeah, you, sure. Because if somebody color. has a sale... Nova no, color. you go to Nova Color? Yeah. Okay, Black yeah. Welder Street, right? Yeah, of course. It's kind of like a ritual for every painter in yeah, this town, right? Yeah, it's Nova Color and then JR is for barbecue right after. Oh, so. okay. <laughs> that's, that's, that, that may be a bigger art world uh, tradition than, <laughs> than Gagosian on Thursdays, let me tell you. So let's look at another one. And, and wait, but just, just for the record, Cars Hiss By My Window is a Doors song, Yeah, right? of course. The Cars yeah. Hiss By My Window. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> so, and now this is more lyrical. Is this an earlier piece? Yes, this is, this is, uh, is, is an earlier piece. Um, I, I got to say, this, this looks almost Matissean. 
I, and you. and I, you know, that could be a compliment, but it might be an insult. You know, I, I so, won't take it as no, an insult. no, no, no. I, you, is that, is so, so you're a fan? Absolutely. Yeah. Oh my God. I'm. A, I'm actually. You know, as as much as I consider myself an abstractionist, I'm probably a, a biggest fan of, uh, of impressionism. Oh really? Um, so absolutely. And I, I kind of, for a while, was really considering my work kind of impressionistic abstraction because. Uh-huh. Uh, it's kind of a slippery slope. Thing, it is. You know? No, it is. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. And, How do you, I mean, at, you at some point, don't, did, you, right. did you feel you had to toughen it up? Well, yeah. I mean, I, and I don't work representationally. So. Because, because like, I mean, I love my mom. She loves impressionism. <laughs> so it's, you know what I mean? It's, yeah, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. you kind of want to stay one step ahead of, absolutely. don't you? Help me out here. You want to stay ahead of your mother for sure. Uh, well, you know, it's like, you know. <laughs> now, when it comes to the quilting, she can kick your ass. But okay. So, so let's, let's now, okay. This is what year, is, what year are we talking here? Uh, this is last year as well. Really? Yeah, okay, this, so so you you're you're this, you're not afraid to just no. This is a this is early. This is probably January. This you you about a year ago. David Bowie died. This one, but the other one, Carrie Fisher died. And, and right, help me out. Here. Okay, no, it's 2016. What a terrible year. Yeah. But but not for your art. Um, now I'm I'm seeing like you're mixing the reds in. There's there's is there reference to life there or is there ocean? I mean, help me out well, here. Well, this one has an extremely long and pretentious title. Uh oh. So um, I like it. There's a little self-effacement in, in you doing this, and, and, I, and I, I really appreciate it. No worries. Um, this one is actually called, um, uh, top, uh, let's see if I can get this one. This one is uh, topograph. Uh, no, excuse me. This one is, uh, oh, God. This Do you have to is, memorize, like, these titles? Come on, man. Yeah, it's Where's the bad. Rolodex? I actually, I actually wrote this one down. This one is um, topographical witness to the collapse of molecular memory. Wow. Yeah. That's terrible. Yeah. I that's know. just, I'm sorry, no, but no. that's, you got to, did you, do you have a shorter I, title now? Can no, you, I don't. It's not, no, at least you didn't do untitled parentheses right. topographical right. da 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 da. Okay, was, so. It was part of a series that I was calling the topographical witness series. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, now see, now that's more interesting. Yeah, thank you. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, and so, so this was kind of the first one. And then the, the number two image is in the vein of that, but, uh, but, but the color uh, palette started to change drastically on the, if uh, we want to go to number two, I can. Wait, oh, you want to go to the, can we go, oh, 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 okay. So now you've really, uh, I want to say you've, you've kind of edited it here. Yeah. Yeah? It's, yeah, it was about kind of leaving a lot of the, the some of the other colors and, and, and some of the, the gestures out, uh, moving a little away from, uh, direct brush strokes and 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 references too yeah although this one also has a very pretentious title as well but well okay okay <laughs> when you say getting away from the brush strokes how did you did you walk through the paint and walk on the canvas help me out here uh no but i mean i'm the the one previous to this and and it was there was a lot of heavy brush stroke and and this one i started to work there's still brush and it's mostly brush but it's it's a lot more active. Um, I started to get a lot more aggressive with the application. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm very, very obsessed with acceleration and, um, and then also somehow finding that balance between acceleration and, and a still equanimity. Um, so, wow. Okay. You know, it's kind of like the ocean is uh-huh. itself. I mean, you know, there's moments when it's the most powerful, crazy, dangerous thing in the world. But then there's a lot of times it's kind of boring. Right. And even at the same time, it can be extremely... Like, let's go out on the sailboat. Uh, is there going to be a hurricane today? Right. I mean, it does go through your head, right? right? It, I'm, it's always, I'm always rooting for the hurricane. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Do, you have a, do you own a sailboat? Uh, no, I don't. No? You, no, don't, you don't go out no. on the ocean? I do no. like to you, sail, though. You do? I, I do. But yeah. you, don't, you just rent one? Um, friends. Really? Yeah. Is there an Uber for sailboats? <laughs> there should be. Though. You know what? There should we be. We should go on Shark Tank let's and get Mark Cuban to give us $200,000 for 30%. I'm not giving you 33% of this business. Okay, sorry. Let's. I take your work seriously, but I just have fun talking to you, so we end up having a good it's goof good. here so let's 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 see uh let's see what else is going on what and this was mid mid-year then yeah okay yeah. and then oh now this okay yeah you recently i did a studio visit uh but you actually had an open studio party so yeah i, 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 I killed two birds yes, with one did. stone yes. so yeah. i always like that so this this is very recent and yes. and how do you apply the paint on this um well it's applied can uh Completely. So the, there's, it's, it's, it starts in a monotone strokes. The entire canvas is completely covered. And then I, uh, use, I use water and I, and I break it all down. Really? Squirt gun? Basically. Yeah? Wow. Yeah. yeah. There's uh, no scrape. It looks so scraped. I was thinking palette well, knife. Well, what happens is those are the, in a sense, kind of the blueprints of the initial strokes. Oh. And, and what happens, um, especially with some of the, 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 
the paints. Um, it tends to be more with the uh, transparent paints is that as, they, as they're washed away, what has stained kind of creates this kind of 50 degree it, reduction okay, in tones. It, it's a fascinating effect and I think you just gave everyone your formula. So I was gonna ask if do you, do you, do you have a sink? I mean, I, no, I, mean, I work. Most of this stuff is big and it's almost all done outside. Oh, with it like a garden hose? Exactly. Wow, really? Yeah. You yeah. know, I'm, I'm thinking Jackson Pollock from Beyond the Grave guiding, that, guiding the, uh, the squirt, you know? Yeah. So you buy, you buy, you buy a, a lot of studio supplies at the garden section of Walmart, right? No? <laughs> Not much. No? Target? No? No? Okay. So, because so, this is a big piece and, 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 and uh, in person it's just feet, totally that's fabulous. six feet by six feet. Wow. 72. Oh, jeez. Uh, uh, not actually, that might be 60 inches. So that's 60, might be five feet. Five feet. Five feet. Five feet. Yeah. It's still, you know what? It's still a whole lot of... It is. It's a lot of real estate it's a lot there. Of space. Who has a wall that big? You know, Hopefully, um, a lot of people. We, 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 you know, push those collectors. Absolutely. Push them. Make, them buy, make them buy the big work. Nope, you got to buy a big one. No, you can't just have a small one. So, no, 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 no. So, let's, uh, and the title of this? This one is, um, Do You Feel Safe? Hey, now there's a title! <laughs> All right! Okay, I think we're, we're I like your evolution here. Yeah, I like no, that. No, the, the next, yeah. Do the, You Feel Safe? Okay. Smaller and smaller. Let's go. See next the one. next one here. Next, okay, cool. Okay, same series. Yes and no. A little um, less tr uh, transparent paint in this one. A little bit less. Um, you know, again, every piece obviously it is extremely unique kind of within itself um, because there's there's no room for going back into it um, it's a very unforgiving process Ooh. Um, but um, in this one i let i let some things happen that i normally would have washed away and so it so you enjoy the natural accidents yeah i mean they drive you crazy but but that's also where all the magic comes from yeah they force you to kind of alter i mean you you, you probably have few plans going in though other than other than the application. I don't, I just have the process. Okay. I really just work. So you really trust the process? I do. Yeah. I do. This and I great. realize that you just this gotta keep pushing through. Now is there, is, there, is, is, it more, um, is it more labor or is there that classic uh, magic that goes on in, in the studio? No, it's, I mean, it's again, it's a very aggressive um, laying down of the, the layers um, and then there's a lot of aggression yeah. in, in removing them as well. Wow. So. Just, Man, that's it's it's a, but it, and it's a physical problem. I mean, does it tire you out? No, it does absolutely. It does. Yeah, yeah, I mean, because I'm uh, most of them are worked uh, flat on the on the ground, and I'm all over them. And, and okay, uh, yeah, I'm definitely. Do you wear sweats or? Well, I get a lot of slack because I, I tend not to, and I tend to just. Oh you no! Know, you come I'm, home I'm, and, I'm, and well, I'm oh, painted no. completely from. Don't well, this drag is home. That a lot paint of, in the, oh, you yeah. have to do it in the backyard. Then. Well, this is yeah. The big ones are done at home in the okay. backyard. Yeah. So, the, so, so, so your studio. You have a studio in Chinatown. I do have a, a new studio in Chinatown, exactly. Um, and I am. I've started working there, but um, it is going to be uh, quite different because it's going to be cons constrained to an indoor space. And you're going to be. Are you going to be will, doing it in the sink? I, I mean, help. Yeah, no, I'm no. not going to. I'm not going to follow this process at all. No. No. So you're just not afraid. You, I mean, you're constantly. You know, look, I'm, I'm still young. I mean, yeah. I'm not, I'm an old guy, but I'm, I'm, I'm young in this and I, and I certainly don't want to. Don't uh, tell me, <laughs> we're about the same age. I think so. Yeah? I think How so. How old are you? I'm, I turn 50 next month, uh, in March. No, I'm 52. So you're a kid. <laughs> you're, you're, so you're born in 67. Yes, I am. Summer, you're born right before summer the summer of love. love. Absolutely. Wow. What a great time to come into the world. I think so. You beat Sergeant Pepper by a month. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, geez. <laughs> okay. So, um. So do you, uh, I mean, you're not afraid to just say, I'm, this is the next, this is my next uh, series. No, because I think everything I'm doing is still related to previous work and it is all an evolution. I mean, this one piece wouldn't have existed without the previous piece we looked at okay. and that couldn't have happened without now, that do, one. Do you ever go back to like, oh, I tried this technique a few series ago, maybe a few years ago, a decade ago, and then, oh, you know what, I used to do it this way. Let me try that again. Um, Reintroduction? Sometimes. Or, I mean, sometimes, after a while, you almost, sometimes I'll go back to a painting that I am thinking about and re-examine it to yeah. kind of try to remember how it happened. Do you ever redo it? The actual yeah. painting itself? Paint over paintings. Yeah. Have you, um, ever, have you ever done that? Yes. Because, I mean, I mean, like, there, you know, there's a story about Motherwell doing that at a museum retrospective. No, I do. I, I do. Because, as I said, it's an unforgiving... Uh, process and so when it goes wrong then I just I then I cover it and and I work in a just kind of I, I go reverse to that so oh yeah instead of breaking it down then I build it up you know because uh, once once that first layer do you keep the first date on there though 
Would you? You don't make it a new painting. Oh no, and, you know it's, what I'm and it's very immediate. It's not like, like 1995 slash 2017. No, 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 no. It's the paintings are all done within their their time. Oh, okay. I'm not coming back. And you know. Okay. Out. Okay. Okay. Good. No. Okay. I just I just wanted to clarify that. Yeah. Wow. 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 So, uh, and how big is this one? This one is six feet by six feet. And you are native to LA. I am. You are. Yeah. Where'd was, you grow up? I grew up in West LA. Um, really? Yep. What, what high school did you go to? I went to Newbridge, which is a oh, yeah. small private oh, yeah, school, yeah, yeah, yeah. but. Prior to that, I went to um, John Burroughs Junior High School. Oh, geez. Okay. Okay. So and, you're okay. Uh, you're definitely a native. Yeah. And now I have to I have to say because you post these things on Facebook sure. and I see them. Don't think I don't see them. But you had a band, <laughs> and you played at Al's Bar. I did. I did. What yeah. was your band? Um, well, that one was Blind Tom. Blind Tom. But, wow. Um, what yeah, other I, bands were you? What well, I was in in middle school. I started being. Uh, it was in kind of a, a lot of just uh, garage kind of punk rock bands. Little punk rock bands, yeah, okay. So I was in a band called UXB. Oh wow! Um, another one called um, the uh, the Social Rejects. Social Rejects. Now that is that's a pretty classic. Punk that, band. There's probably about fifty bands in yeah, the, in, in, L, in Southern California, yeah. or probably in the United States. There's been fifty bands called Social Rejects. Yeah. None of which ever got out of the garage. <laughs> but one of your bands, you got actually because I said, man, you played at Al's Bar. That's a you know yeah, that's that kind of like that that's like fun. you hit you hit this yeah. level. And yeah. I was actually in college. I was in a kind of a goth punk band wow. called uh, Penny Dreadful. And, oh, no, no, I've heard of the Penny yeah. Dreadfuls. You guys had some success. Um, no, that wasn't us. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, somebody took your name and ran? Well, I, who knows? Who knows who came first? This was, you know, 85. Oh, and, that was um, before the Penny Dreadfuls. Yeah, oh, it was, wow. you know, we would play like a lot of... Did um, you ever send them a cease and desist letter? No, no? not at all. It was already not over all. and then, they, then the, new, the new one no, started? No. But that band was cool. That band actually had uh, Gillian Welch on bass, uh -huh. who is went on to become like a Grammy Award winning yeah, yeah. like folk singer. And, oh yeah. Um, but that was that was at UC Santa Cruz, which is where oh, you, went, I went. you went to Santa Cruz. Yeah, I went. Oh to, wow, I have a sister up in Santa Cruz. Yeah, yeah. So oh, I wow, went wow. there, and that was where I went initially to to study the art and that whole bit. Good art department. I thought so. Yeah. 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 Definitely. Was abstract painting? I mean, were you? Did you abstract painting rebel against? No, them I was there? doing. You know, I was doing kind of your classic undergraduate. You know, a little bit of everything. You know, oh, yeah. just to follow the program. That's what school's for. That's what. That's what you're supposed to be doing. Make your student art and enjoy it. Yeah. Okay. But speaking of which, we have a sketch oh, of I our get. Oh, show. what? Can I? I oh, you got to plug your yeah, show. I got to plug the show. Plug your show. Please, please. So I Today do is, a, we're, uh, we're filming this January 29th, 2017, on February 10th, that's right. 2017. That's a Thursday, right? That's uh, a Friday. A Friday. Friday, February 10th. Where is it at? Uh, Mid-City Art House. Mid-City Art, Art House. House. Which is on uh, 5555 West Washington. 5555 West Washington. Wow, that's, well, that's memorable. Just, uh, just a couple blocks east of Fairfax. Oh, okay. So, so a little east of Fairfax. Yeah. Well, we, can go, we can go to Cantor's, or of course... We can go to, we'll see you all at Okie Dog, right? Absolutely. <laughs> sure, we can sign our contract. Wow, wow, wow. So that opens, and when's that show run till? That show will run a month. Um, it will have a, uh, a kind of a nice closing on uh, March 12th, but the, the big opening is Friday, February 10th. Friday, February 10th. I wouldn't want to miss it. I wouldn't want you to miss it, but I don't want Lauren to miss from the Skechers seat. Oh, can't wait. The fabulous portrait by wow. our intern, Eliza awesome. of... Lauren Phillip, 1L, no S, Lauren Phillip. Lauren, thanks so much for Thank being on pleasure. Modern Art Blitz. Thanks for wearing that Germs t-shirt. I love awesome. it. Awesome. And uh, we got a great, great portrait. I of dig you it. That, that could be on Thank money you, one day, you know, look at it. That could be, that could be on like the, the $50 bill. Uh, there we go. You know, nice. Don't you think? Yeah. All, All right. right. All right. Hey, thanks for joining us on Modern Art Blitz. We do this every Sunday live at five on dronebox.com. We're archived on Modern Art Blitz blitz.com via our YouTube channel and I have to thank as I do every episode for the things running smooth in the booth our producer director Abel Alejandre we'll see you next Sunday oh wait next Sunday's the Super Bowl we're not gonna be on we're gonna be on this Friday though no nice. Thursday oh shit Thursday. Thursday oh god I hope I show up now Thursday at six we're gonna have an episode